Today we are going to be adding who I think is the best starting pitcher in the game to the squad. This 96 overall Tom Glavin is absolutely insane. And you get him from collecting a lot of bums from the NLEs. The one player that we are missing is 91 overall Andrew Jones. You get him from collecting all the Atlanta Braves players on the 40-man roster. And of course, they're the most expensive team in the East. I have almost every single Braves player that I need, except for some bums named Ronald Lacuna Jr., who's only the NL MVP frontrunner this year, and Freddie Freeman, who was last year's MVP. So we got a couple of MVPs that we need, and of course, they're expensive as shit. Luckily, I'm rich, bitch! So in this video, we will be getting Tom Glavin, Ronald Lacuna Jr., Freddie Freeman, and from collecting all these Atlanta Braves players, we also get this 91 overall Andrew Jones. So a lot of new players are going to be joining the squad today. But to make things a little bit cheaper, I hope, I got five Ballin is a Habit packs. You get these packs from the BR Reward Program. 80 stars, I got 80 stars exactly. We got five Ballin is a Habit packs, baby. I usually don't have the best pack luck, but I am hoping for at least one diamond. Try to make this set easier. Not there. We're gonna get a silver. Ian Anderson. I already have him, but he's brave and true Pomerantz. Pomerantz, fuck! I just got one expensive diamond. Hey, we got a gold diamond. Nope, we got double golds. Jeff McNeil and Eloy Jimenez. Last two ball in this habit back. Dude, if I pull frickin' Acuna, that'd be... Nope, I am not. We are getting all the potteries. Jeez. We are down to our final pack. Five ball in this habit packs, and I'm not gonna pull a single diamond. A single diamond. We got five-star golds. We got another brave. And of course, like I said, I already have them all. So now, the expensive part. I gotta spend 200k on one player. But we're gonna be somewhat smart with this. Somebody wants to buy him for 196,000. I'm gonna buy him for 196.01. Bitch. We also need Freddie Freeman, who's going for like 38k too. And now we wait. Two hours later. So of course the servers went down, but we finally got them. Now we just gotta add them to the collection right here, and we get this 91 overall Andrew Jones, who actually looks pretty solid. He's got great power stats. Good defense. We'll pull up at him in center field. Fuck around and see how he does. We have now completed the entire NL East. And with that, we get the best pitcher in the game, Tom Clavin. This is from when he got 300 wins in his career. Like I said, best card in the game. His stats are ridiculous. Great per nines. Good pitch selection. He's going to be starting today. So now all we need to do is complete the NL West. We will get Steve Finley and we will also get 99 overall Alfonso Soriano. So if you guys want to see that video, be sure to hit that like button. So from doing that collection alone, we got four new starters on the squad. We got Ronald Acuna in right, Byron Fuxton in center, Andrew Jones in left, Gallo, Ernie Beggs, Kess Daddy, and Freddie Freeman over at first round up the infield, Mike the Pizza Man behind the plate, then obviously making his first start team, Tom Glavin. But if you enjoyed these type of gameplay videos, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel if you're new, and we'll do an Alfonso Soriano gameplay next. All right, boys, let's see what we're going up against today. Okay, I got this. So we get to test out this Tom Glavin right away. I'm gonna bust him inside right there. That sinker's got some movement to it. Tom Glavin has a, oh shit, I made him a miss. Freaking idiot, am I right? Who's been very late, very early. Dude, I'm missing my spot, but he swings right through. Tom Glavin with his first K. Oh my god, he is not touching it. One, two count. He's been early on change up so far. CK, dude, he is not even close to touching that. I made a mistake. I made a mistake. Nope, just came to Kestaddy over there at second base. Makes throw. Good inning for Tom Glavin. See if Byron, Jesus Christ. Walker throws very hard and we fly out on the first pitch. We got Andrew Jones up with his first at bat. I am late as shit. Dude, I suck. We're just out here guessing right now. Yep. Yep, that that was bad. <laughs> All right, maybe Acuna will make me look better. Side. Nope, he didn't throw it inside, but that might get down in the gap. Ronald Acuna drives one to the ball. That's going to at least be two. We're going to stay at second. We got two out double from Acuna. We got the legend, Young Jesus, Joey Gallo up. See if we can drive one here. Oh, I, I'm on it, but I'm early. Oh, did I get that? Joey Gallo, to the wall! Joey Gallo hits one out! Two run bomb! We were early as f on that! Okay! I ain't gonna lie, I didn't deserve that. Let's see if he can keep up. Oh, what happened? Oh, Jesus. 
He actually smokes it right to left field. Andrew Jones with his first action. I don't know. I feel like I've been making a lot of mistakes so far, but Tom Glavin with the finesse. That changeup is disgusting. Let's see if we can bust him inside. Nope, he's able to make contact with it, but a weak fly ball to Andrew Jones, two outs. He's been so early on this changeup every single time. I don't think he can make enough contact. Hits it weakly over to third base. Gallo throws a piss missile over the first three outs. I also forgot we got Freddie Freeman in the lineup. I plugged him in see how he does in his debut now last year's MVP the Braves have this year's MVP and they still suck we're starting to work the comp better with it we're putting better swings on pitch we swing at that though oh we ground out weekly the second so we got Kess daddy up we are hitting a whopping 444 with this card too bad he sucks in real life oh and he sucks in the game too I will never understand Oh, somebody's average is better than his on base percentage. It's because I swing at everything. Also, why do I have Ernie batting eight? Oh, because he is a bomb ass eight hitter into the gap to the wall. Ernie Banks with a 12 double. All right, uh, Tom Glavin's gonna swing for the fences here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, that didn't work. We're gonna start him out with a big curveball. Jesus Christ. What Tom's Glavin throwing too slow, or is this guy just bad? I'm gonna go with an airbender inside. That was freaking disgusting. The thing I've really noticed this year compared to other years, maybe I'm just making shit up, it happens, but players like Corbin Burns and Tom Glavin who have 99 break, you really notice the break on their pitches. We got Walker Beeler's day off up now. If he's the one that actually makes solid contact, I'm gonna be pissed. Buxton! Leave to me to give up the first hit to the goddamn pitcher. Well, there goes the no-no. I had hope with swings like that, too. We're gonna go an inside Ooh. sinker, see if he can... What the fuck just happened? <laughs> All right, just like that, we're tied. But when he put up just god-awful swings, first two and like swings like that, I didn't think he'd hit the ball. What I thought was gonna be a blowout is now a tie game. We have to top the order up, see if we can put some good swings. Oh my god! Buxton Buxton fucks that ball, hits at the pound town, home on the left field, and we got the lead back. I've noticed though, if we don't chase at the bad shit, he usually pitches a pitch right down the middle eventually. That ball's hit well. Acuna! Oh, he can't get it! That's gonna be a triple! Maybe! Crap! The other guy got to it! Get down! Ronald Acuna is only a homer and a single away from the cycle. That was a big hit though, because now we got a guy in third with under one out with Joey Gallo up. It's just a matter if he can make contact. Pitch number eight of the bat, we're battling. We're battling Joey Gallo, great at bat, draws the walk. Runners on the corner for the pizza man. Can he deliver? Oh, he's getting a big fat tip tonight. He gets it down, get by him! Oh crap, we're going to second. What am I doing? Pizza man, get down! Safe! Let's go, baby. We get the two-run lead right back with Freddie Freeman up, and I missed a fastball right down the dick. Oh, oh my god, I am under that. Base hit still scores two. Base hit still... I thought it was a base hit. Where? Gotcha, bitch! This ballsy son of a bitch just went home on two outs. The changeup's been wonders for us so far. Oh my god. Oh, I pitched that right down the middle. He is late on it, sends the sinker deep to right, but Acuna's there, two outs. And we get him to the ground out. Keston makes the play over the first. Four innings completed, and so far, I'm liking this Clavin. Got Ernie stirring it off. Ernie absolutely clobbers that. I might have just been under it. Did he get enough? Wow. That ball went nowhere. Byron Fox didn't hit a bomb his last time up. See if he can keep it going. I want to keep banging on this leap. I don't want him to quit. Oh god, he might not with swings like that. Oh, Byron, we are all over that. I don't think he got enough. We fly out to the warning track, man. I need to go up with that. Change up. Oh, he actually gives us that ride. Buxton, get on your horse, big fella. <laughs> Give me that shit. I don't think we've thrown a pure fastball this game. Wow. Late. Sounds about right. Whatever, it gets a two out late hit. We just gotta make sure. Come on, Acuna, come get that. Good play. I was going to say we got the pitcher up now, but frickin' Beeler got a double the last time out. It doesn't matter. He flies out here. Acuna with the catch. Everybody in this debut is playing pretty good besides Andrew Jones. So I got to get some going with him. We hit a hard ball down the line. Oh, perfect, perfect. Acuna, did he get it? 
God, what a debut for him. Oh, that ball smoke. Of course. One, two to Mike. Wow, I just looked stupid. And I think we just struck him on three pitches. I just called my freaking shot. I'm gonna go change up inside or right down the middle is what I meant. And he rolls over it, grounds out to Ernie, who throws a rocket first two outs. If we can put a good swing on this one. I got really horny when I saw that pitch and I grounded out. That sucks. Come on, Cast Daddy. Cast Daddy to the freaking moon. Let's go, baby. Hits one out the left. There we go. Oh my god, did Ernie just go back to back? We were on it. We're early to the wall. He jumped. Get out of here, that Ernie thinks. We go back to back like Jordan 96 97. I should never do that again. O2 count, chase the change up, Keston, oh my god, Keston, you sexy son of a bitch, make the play over there. He's starting to make solid contact with the slow stuff, ah, oh, fuck me. He freaking hits an absolute bomb, but we got a ground ball the third to end the inning. Oh, is that freaking Andrew Jones? Andrew Jones, deep, he jumps, oh Jones with a bomb to center field. I wasn't even paying attention, but he fucked that ball. Ronald Acuna is up. He is a single away from the cycle in his debut. Oh, he did. Acuna absolutely drills that one. That ball's to the wall. Oh my God, he just missed hitting one out. Oh, we smoked that one. I hate this game. We are in the eighth inning, only at 79 pitches. You know I am going for the complete game with Tom Glavin. He's made two mistakes, but other than that, he's been damn near perfect. We contact all night, except that drives me to the wall. We got him. Oh, this is gonna be an easy complete game. Throw the piss missile over there. We are through eight innings. So out of the quartet of Braves we have on the team, Freddie Freeman is the only one without a hit so far. Oh, and that just changed. I'm just kidding. All three have home runs. Get out, ball. Let's go. Oh, my God. Andrew Jones with a home run. Acuna with a home run. Freddie Freeman with a home run. And Tom Glavin pitching a gem. The quartet of Braves are freaking going off. Tom Glavin staying in to hit. It'd be really cool if I go yard with him. Bah! Nope. Three outs away from a complete game with Tom Glavin. We're up six runs, so I'm not too worried. We're gonna get him with the change up here. He rolls over it, hits another weak ball to third base. Gallo gains some action over there, one way. All right, Tommy G, let's not go freaking walking guys out here. Two strike count, I wanna make him look stupid. Can I throw this for a strike? That wasn't even close. Damn it! He's been rolling over this change up lately. See if he does it again, he actually hit it up the middle. Okay. Can I just end this game already? Oh my god. <gasps> Alright, the bases are loaded with only one out here. What is going on? One, two count. Can we get a big strike out here? We get him. Is that playable? Freddy? Freddy? Ah! Pitch number eight of this at bat. I'm telling you, I'm gonna make a mistake here and all of a sudden it's going to be a game. No, it is not. We get him to fly out to Keston. Two outs. We're over the century mark. 100 pitches. Bases loaded, two outs. He hits a grand slam here. All of a sudden, this game gets a little interesting. I'm gonna keep jamming him inside with pitches, see what he does here. Oh, yes! What are you doing? Throw the ball! I didn't think he was gonna throw a damn ball. We get the W. Player of the game is Ronald Acuna Jr. In his debut, he went three for four with a triple, a double, and a home run. His fourth at bat, we couldn't get the single for the cycle. But Tom Glavin with the win, he went nine innings, only gave up six hits, five strikeouts, one walk, three earned runs on two home runs that he hit, and then some other notable players we had, obviously Acuna. Ernie Banks was two for four with a home run. Gala was one for three with a home run. And Buxton hit a home run as well. And it's not even showing the rest of the guys. Andrew Jones in his debut, one for four, hit a home run. Freddie Freeman in his debut, one for four with a home run. So we tested out a quartet of Braves. Tom Glavin pitched a complete game. Acuna hit a home run, including almost hanging for a cycle. Andrew Jones hit a home run, and Freddie Freeman hit a home run. So that was pretty nasty. But hopefully, boys, enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new, and hopefully we'll get the Alfonso Soriano collection done here in the new future. We'll play some BR or some grind it out. But hopefully, boys, enjoyed, and I'm out. Peace.